Today's Cooking with Olivia, sponsored by Max Fresh Market. Four or five months ahead. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm We're already celebrating um, Super Bowl, actually. Yes. <laughs> and um, uh, um, Olivia is making a wonderful little dish that you can bring to any Super Bowl party and pep everybody up and get them into the spirit. So anyway, hey y'all, and welcome back to Cooking with Olivia. I am super excited for today because this coming up Sunday is the Super Bowl, and I know a lot of y'all are excited to get in your snacks and get in your mm -hmm. people and everyone ready to come to the Super Bowl for your house and everything. But uh, going to the Super Bowl this year are the Patriots against the Rams. We are definitely going to the Patriots. Um, the, uh, <laughs> the Saints, Saints is our team. <laughs> I know. And, uh, you know, a lot of people are still arguing about the Saints, and Saints is still making them. I mean, definitely is for sure made history you about make some this. enemies if you're going yeah. for the Rams, maybe. So, yeah, you know, so, uh, <laughs> but anyway, Saints, Saints definitely played very good this year. They, uh, they did really good, so... Saint your show number one team. <laughs> Mine too. Definitely. So anyway, today we are making cream cheese bombs. And this is something so super, I'm sorry, something so simple and so easy for your uh, Super Bowl. So let's get started. So you just want to get a uh, just, just a regular size big bowl to, to be able to fit your filling. We're going to do one eight ounce uh, package of cream cheese. And we just kind of cut them up in little dices. Put that in there. And then we're going to add a one fourth cup of grated Parmesan cheese. And make sure your cream cheese is room temperature. And then we're going to do one package of bacon, cook all that, and you that just want to uh, kind of crunch it all up. We're going to add that in there. And we're going to add in one package of uh, fi finely chopped uh, green onions. Yeah. And then we're going to add in one teaspoon of garlic salt. Let's get that in there. That's interesting. I'm telling you, the garlic salt really, really makes it. I'm going to have to taste it again with the garlic salt. Let's so... We're gonna go ahead and uh, mix this up, and sometimes I will, just for just because. Don't worry, my hands are clean, but I mean, I'm going to get in here with my hands because it is hard. To, it, it it definitely is hard to mix cream cheese up with. Um, oh, oh. Here, I'll pull it up for pull you. Pull it up for me. Thank you. Here you go. She did that before. So anyway, since this may take a little bit, when you're um, for, for your Pillsbury, you just want to get the regular Pillsbury. Okay. And you just want to. Um, they, it could come, like, in a 10-pack and stuff like that, just depending on the guest you're, just depending on, like, the people you're feeding and everything. Yeah. And you just, if you want to, you can kind of do a little uh, egg white right there on them. Oh, okay. So, uh, while I'm still mixing this, uh, Miss Ashley, if you want to, what, what you do is you can just put a little egg white on there. All right. And I'm just kind of brush it. And you just kind of brush all of them. They're still stacked a little bit because we got to figure all that out. Do you want me to unstack them? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, so here's one. Here, split that right there real quick. Let me get this napkin. Little thing. Okay, so okay. my hands are not going to get fully cleaned. But right here. Here, let me see this real quick. Okay. So, oh, I'm sorry. Okay, so this right here, what you want to do, we're going to put these back there real quick. You want to get your two fingers. Mine are very messy right now. You just want to spread this all apart like that. Just kind of get it spread all through evenly. And that's where you want to get your spoon just like a regular spoon and you want to put it right there in the middle like that oh wow and then you want to like do all that and just kind of oh that is easy yes create it like that okay then put, put it in a little ball mm -hmm. spray your pan and how long do you cook get it your egg whites you're going to do it for 350 degrees for 20 to uh 10 minutes and then you want to get your cheese and you want to get your we got Parmesan cheese in that, and there you go. That's it. And you put the cheese on before you cook it, or? No, yes, you put the cheese on before you cook it, so it's nice and golden brown. Here, here's your stuff. That's okay. These are so good. And yes. they're, I mean, they're easy. Look. Oh, my hands are so messy. Ah, uh, look at the middle of them. They're wonderful. And these are great oh, for Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. You can get this recipe at myarclemist.com. We'll be right back. These are so Today's Cooking with Olivia, sponsored by Max Fresh Market.